Hi, this is Rahul and welcome back to my blog. Planning to buy a solar system for your house, there are few things you need to keep in mind. Anytime you pick a solar company, they're gonna give you three choices, mostly two, but there's a third choice too. Number one, obviously, is to buy the system. Number two is to lease the system. And number three is that a solar company will become your utility company. And pretty much instead of paying your bills to your utility company, your electric company like Addison or any other company, you end up paying every month a utility bill to the solar company. The best choice is to get and own the system. Number two is to lease it. I only say if you want to lease the property, there should be only one reason. And most likely that reason is that when you are buying a property as an investment property, if you're gonna live in your house, there are a few things you have to keep in mind also that how long you plan to stay. I know things change. Usually people end up staying in their house for not more than five years. But if you're living in a bigger house, you, you know, you already maxed out on your budget and stuff and the kids are going to school, you already know that you know they're not gonna move the school for next few years. Then you know you have to take a look at that part and see where you are in your life. If you think you're gonna be in that house for a couple of years, I, I would stay away from putting a solar system. I'm gonna analyze and say, oh, you know what, let's check how much you're gonna spend on your utilities versus buying a whole new system for yourself, yeah? Keep that one thing in mind, how long you're gonna stay in the house. Secondly, leasing sometimes looks very lucrative. But keep in mind that is not your system. You always want to buy your system and by financing it, there might be a very little price difference. The most important thing here to know also is that when you buy a property, there would be a day when you're exiting of the property. If you have a lease, there's a good chance that one, their pool of uh, buyers would not like to see a lease. Second, there would be pool of buyers who are not credit worthy enough. So they might not qualify to take over the lease. Keep that thing in mind. Buying is a very good option. Leasing uh, is the second uh, option you have to keep in mind. Financing is good, but what happens is, you know, you can always roll in the price and you can always pay off your, uh, your uh, solar system at the close of escrow and hike the price accordingly. Call me if you would like to know more about this. We can sit and drill deep and see what is the right thing for you to do for your investment. Call us anytime. Uh, the Bagat Group at EXP has been in business for since 2005 and would love to sit with you, drill deep more for, uh, into this solar system for you and see what best we can advise. Call us anytime, thank you.